Hi guys, it's me, Red, and I am coming at you with a new video. So I know I haven't uploaded in two months, but I know I keep on saying this, but I've just been so, so busy, and it's really hard to try and fit my social media side of life into my real life. Um, considering I've started my exams, and I've had a lot of... Uh, medical issues recently so that is why I've been finding it a lot harder to upload videos but this Thursday yes I have a half day so I'll only be at school for a few hours so when I come home I'm going to upload a pre-made uh, video which I'm really excited for you guys to see but today's video is kind of a trendy video well it is trends from the 2000s which is the decade I was born the 2000s and um, so I think the trends from the 2000s they're um they're strange and different and I looked up some images and I found some that relate to the dog post for ODO and I have McKenna and Molly who are going to wear those there's going to be a few hairstyles in there as well so let's get into today's video outfit that Molly is wearing. So the 2000s was like a really big year for um, the Demon jacket which is from our generation. Um, the skirt is also from our generation. It was like um, roller skirts, rollerblade skirts, roller skate skirts, something like that. They're, they're still popular today but they were popular in 2000s. Um, a tube top, this is white, which is handmade by yours truly. But it actually has sleeves on it, but for the benefit of this video. And then trainers were also like a really big thing. Those trainers are from Designer Friends, which is a British company. Okay then. So let's start off with Kenna's hair. Um, normally there was like more than one braid, but like I decided to just do one because I think it just suits McKenna a lot more. So there used to be like small sections of braids and the hair, which was pretty trendy at the time. So there used to be just random sections of braids. Sometimes people would braid all their hair. Um, so like a tank kind of tank top thing, um, with ripped or ribbed, I think it is, like sleeves. Um, so these are meant to be kind of like bell bottom jeans but they don't really look like it because she's wearing boots <laughs> so and um, boots were a thing but these were actually Uggs well they're from American Girl so this is from American Girl they're pretty and plaid outfit um, uh, Julie's classic meat outfit from American Girl handmade by me and um, her hair's just out Okay then, so this outfit in particular is like nostalgia for me because let's go down to the bottom. Do, 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 do. Okay, so the bottom was starting off with these um leggings from these were off the doll that I had ages ago, like the 18 inch doll, so doesn't matter about those. And um, these shoes are from the Fluttershy outfit by our generation. The dress is a uh, purpley pretty plaid, purpley plaid outfit from Birkin Girl. Obviously her necklace is uh, Molly's meat necklace. Um, 
wearing a dress with leggings or anything like yoga pants or things like that was very 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 popular in the 2000s so something that I think I even will like if I lots of pictures of me I'll probably find myself wearing an outfit like that when I This is my absolute favourite. I love this outfit and um, one reason is it's pretty much all from the same place. I mean, this is a Nikki's complete meat outfit. Nikki was girl of the year 2007, so she was in 2000. Even though she's American and I'm British, there's still like some kind of combination of the 2000s. For instance, the um, the embroidered skirt. Embroidered like trousers and skirts was so popular. And then it's like a cowgirl kind of inspired thing which was also really loved. Button down shirts for women and then like these patterned headscarves were also really in. And these uh, cowgirl boots which are leathery kind of and have the heel on the back. So I forgot this brown bag as well as part of the I'll just put it on now. This is from our generation, the... I can't remember the name of the outfit, I'm sorry I got it so young. <laughs> I got it when I first started collecting dolls. Um, yeah, this beautiful brown bag, like a purse. Um, these were very popular as well, especially like this exact kind of style. Okay then, so this outfit it has also some embroidery on it around the neck. Baggy tops were kind of a thing, 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 depending on um, what part of the 2000s you're looking at. I think that was more popular in the early stages and then it dropped down towards 2010s. Um, Skirts and tights and boots, obviously boots were always a thing, along with brown tights, like brown and black tights were a thing with boots, and a plaid skirt. Uh, like I said, the top is baggy, which like I said, depending on where you look, was popular in the 2000s. It is pretty basic and it wasn't as popular this was more like the wintry kind of stages a long sleeved white shirt which i actually took from matt and alex so i need to get that back some uh, jeans um they're actually high-waisted these ones but low-waisted were a thing so luckily she's got a long top so um short waist um, boots again which were always kind of like a really it was a statement to wear boots and trainers and kind of like converse and like <laughs> high tops it was just always really a trend so let's finish this video up so then across the 2000s my decade that I was born in there was a lot of um, there was a lot of strange fashion. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. Like some of the fashion that I like, some of them I don't. So I like the denim jackets, the boots, and the, and the trainers. Um, but there were definitely some weird ones out there that I didn't have the outfits for so I didn't do them I just did the most general and popular ones a bit of a mix and a match so 
What do you guys think of the 2000s? Comment down below, I would really, I would really like to know. And also comment down below what year you were born in. So 2000s, 90s, maybe even a bit before that. So thank you so much for watching this video and I really hope you enjoyed. Um, please comment, like and subscribe for new and more content. Check out my past videos and see if you like them as well. There's more videos like this all over the HLF. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you on Thursday hopefully. So bye for now guys. Bye. Red, McKenna and Molly out.